Hello everyone, it's me ASMR welcoming you to my new Photoshop tutorials and today I'll show you the preset which is the moody outdoor and some of my fans asked me or requested me to make the green color like uh, paste and uh, teal like actually and how to make out and what will be the preset settings and other stuff. So let's start the tutorial. If you are new in my channel, please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications. So I have lots of stock image from unsplash.com I downloaded. I'll provide you the download link in my video description. So at first the image was uh, this image, the main image actually. And press Ctrl or Command J. I made a preset for you guys and I'll provide you that preset download link in my video description. Before that, I want to discuss about the settings. What was the settings in that preset? So after that, going to the filter and camera filter. This one is another plugins, you know that which is really helpful and similar to the Lightroom and the photo editing ultimate solution. The camera version 13.0.2, I'm using the updated one. Please find the download link in my video description. Here the smallest menu, three dots, going to the load settings options and here the outdoor XMP and this one the settings. And in this case, I'm just getting the light is not okay. That means a little bit down. In this case, you have to make it up and it could be just because of your image and my example image is not same. And uh, in this case, you should just customize the settings like a light or exposure, contrast, highlights, shadow, whatever it is. The basic things you can do that. So let's see what was the settings here. The temperature, the plus 5 and 10 plus 1 and the exposure plus 0, 3. Uh, 0.03 actually the contrast plus 65 and highlight minus 67 and the shadow plus 71 on whites that is minus 64 and blacks that is plus 26 and clarity plus 19 and vibrance minus 26 and down for the basic and curves from here the rgb curves here the input value 0 and the output value 0 input value 50 output value 57 and the input value 125 and output value 127 here the input value 201 and output value 2010 and here the input value 255 and output value 255 now done in the curves detailing options no settings i used over here the color mixture the, the most important part of the color photo editing the hue which color will be it defines with the hue saturation the percentage of the color and luminance intensity of the color let's see what is the settings here the red hue that is 44 and the orange minus 13 and yellow plus 0 and green uh, plus 11 that's why you're getting the uh, this type of greens and uh, blue minus 31 purple minus 38 magenta minus 20 and the saturation percentage of the color all these steps are in a negative that means the negative value uh, like desaturated minus 24 red orange minus 18 yellow minus 18 green minus 44 aqua minus 33 blue minus 40 and purple minus 31 and the magenta minus 20 intensity zero for the red orange plus 7 yellow plus 11 green plus 24 aqua plus 31 blue plus 33 and the purple plus 31 and magenta plus 38 this one is the secret actually to make this type of color now the color grading most important thing just because of the shadow color highlight color and mid-tone color three color defines with the color grading this one is the secret of the color grading here at first in the shadow portion here sometimes you don't get this one just press the small triangle you'll get the three lines or three sliders one is the hue here the hue value which color will be defined with that that is plus 32 actually 32 actually and the saturation plus 18 or 8 for the luminance you know the percentage and the luminance intensity and which color you want to give in the shadow portion this number define that color okay in a mid-tone 119 the value of the color and the 16 for the saturation and 0 for the luminance and here hue 32 saturation 16 that's fine and going to the optics no optics geometry and effects no effects and calibration in this portion minus 100 for the hue red primary and the saturation plus 71 
and the hue for the green primary plus 100 and minus 48 for the saturation and blue primary minus 13 and saturation plus 28 and now hit the ok button don't worry about that i saved these settings for you guys and i'll provide you that download link in every description so before and after okay let's try the other image i'm not saving this one okay going to the file and uh, just open up here uh, image which is the another image actually i want to provide this image okay uh, already this one is edited uh, I should try the non edited image. This one or this one is not edited. Okay. Press controller command J. Going to the filter, camera filter, and the load settings options. And then the outdoor XMP, and you are getting the color like that. In this case, if you need to change the uh, saturation, go to the color mixture, go to the saturation and green saturation. You can change it out and from the hue you can make the hue like this and in this case you can change it out before and after and hit ok so uh, at first i just said that um, this example image and your image lightings and other stuff is not same so according to your image you should change the settings or customize the settings it will be more uh, like a smarter if you want to get the full output of the preset so hope that you learn a lot from this video if you did please thumbs up and share to your friend and if you have any kind of question query request please do comment on my video comment section until the next video i may say my signing out today stay safe stay at home keep me in your prayers as well Bye bye